Hi guys, it's Kat. Welcome to a what we had for dinner video. So this first one you'll see, this is three meals from the week prior and then four meals from this past week. This one here is just macaroni and cheese with chicken. This is really simple and easy and I may or may not have hid some vegetables in this cheese sauce. My children never have to know. And then I also made some garlic bread to go alongside. I didn't have the macaroni though and I don't quite remember what it is that I did have. Um, I'm eating just a little bit differently. Okay, and then we had breakfast for dinner. We have this at least once a week. My son, Wesley, who is six, absolutely loves it. You can see these eggs are super hot because you can actually see some steam still coming off of them. This is a Mickey Mouse pancake. I freehanded that. That's why it doesn't look all that good. With some cheesy scrambled eggs and some bacon. Benji had eggs. He's been real fussy about eggs recently, but he did eat the ones that I made for him, which I was thankful for. Then we had chicken parmesan. Um, this is just the Stouffer's brand. This is not homemade or anything. I'd had a lupus flare up for the past couple weeks, so I was making pretty simple meals. Um, everybody likes this. It's not the best thing on the planet for you by any means, but it is delicious and it's very easy to make. You just throw it in the oven for about an hour and 15 minutes and it is done. So we did that with the other loaf of garlic bread that we had, and that's the third meal from the other week. Now moving on to this past week. On Monday, I made barbecued chicken sliders. I just used that pork roast that kept getting moved around on the meal plan into the crock pot with some Sunny's barbecue sauce. If you don't know what Sunny's is, Sunny's is a barbecue restaurant that is down south. Um, I ate at that, them a lot when I lived in uh, Florida. And my mom sent us a jug of their sweet sauce that she found at Sam's Club down there. So I did that on some buns with these are just scalloped potatoes. I made them out of a box. And those are some honey roasted baby carrots. The carrots didn't turn out as well as they usually do. I'm not 100% sure what happened with that, but they were still good. They just weren't as good as they normally are. I'm not, like I said, I'm not really 100% sure what went wrong. Then we had breakfast for dinner. This is an everything bagel, and I made bagel sandwiches. This has ham that you'll see right there. What you can't see is that there's eggs, cheese, and bacon on this as well. Uh, Isabel had cream cheese on hers, as did my husband, and Wesley and I had mustard on ours. These are banana chips and halos on the side. They were really good. Everybody enjoyed it. Um, I don't remember if I made Benji eggs this time or not, but that's what we did on Tuesday. Wednesday, um, my crock pot really had its chance to shine this past week. I used it twice, first with the sliders, then with this. This is one of those little beef roast kits that you can find in the grocery store. This was the pork one. It was by Tyson. I just threw everything in the crock pot. The only thing I did first was I did quarter the potatoes and cut the onion up into slightly smaller pieces. Um, just so they were a little bit more manageable. Then you just let it cook in your crock pot all day. For I guess three to four hours if you put it on high. But we didn't do that. On the Thursday I made ravioli for the kids. Cheese ravioli. Um, and that's just with some spaghetti sauce. And some bread. And then I didn't have this. I had zoodles which you will see in just a second. That's what I had. And then on Friday, instead of pizza, we ended up having McDonald's. The kids hadn't had it for a while and were asking for it, but I forgot to get video of that. All right, guys, I'll catch you next time. Bye.